Welcome to Accounting 101, the basics about how to be a good accountant. Basically, rule number one, you need lots and lots of pens, right? So I got that sorted, easy peasy. Then you need a good old fashioned, what's that? A good old fashioned calculator. I got that. It, it definitely works, definitely works. Don't you worry about that. But uh, I'm going to be, te uh, hang on a minute. What is that? I'm getting a fax. Of course, you need a fax as well to be an accountant. That's very important, but... Oh, yeah, right. We're actually doing football manager. So we're running a football club. Oh, yeah. Apparently, we got a, a fax from uh, from Liverpool. Never limp again. Definitely Liverpool, right? Yeah, Frank, we want to buy in Dumbley. We don't know either. Right. Well, that should be interesting, right? His value is 50 to 55 million. Not bad, not bad. Let's see what they have to offer, then. Oh, they offer 12 million. 12 million. Right, let's just get the good old calculator out here. Yeah, I, I, I don't think that's a very good piece. Oh, uh, sorry, sorry, sorry. When you actually do calculate stuff, you need to do this. That's that's rule number two as accounting or three or wherever I am at. But uh, yeah, let's just go back to the accounting. I can't, I, I can't work under this pressure. The fax is going mental again. Oh, this is some sort of fancy, fancy language. El, el faxo, el faxo. Hola, Senor Sigurdsson. We want her to buy Senor Ben Davis. Ben Davis, I mean, I could get rid of him. I already have Regulon, right? He's pretty good, but uh, let's see what they're willing. So his value is 26 to 31 million. Not bad, not bad. Uh, uh, our offer 6 million, por favor. Por, por favor? Uh, por, por non favor, no, no, no. That is not, that is not how we do business. 6 million, that's... Oh, fuck. Can't I... Oh, I can't... I can't get a moment of peace around here. What? What is this? Faxometer from Woman UFC MMA Gods. What? Oh, yeah, because in-game, of course, they're called Man. Man UFC MMA Gods. Yeah, it does make sense, because I remember they had that MMA champion. Uh, what was his name? Kantner. Kantner. He was sick MMA fighter. I've seen that one clip where he just throws a flying kick. That was incredible. He won the championship there, right? I think so. So it makes sense, I guess. Um, it says, Yeah, what, mate? We mad for Ndombele. We'll pay out? 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 O-W-T. What, what kind of accent is this? Well, his value is still 50 to 55. And Man United, they're, they're pretty rich. Let's see. Our mint offer 20 million top banana ya. Top banana ya? What on? What on earth are they playing? A top banana? Top banana? For crying out loud. It's all kicking off. Oh. Oh, this is an interesting one. It's from a car. Is it from a car? Oh, it's from Wolfsburg. All oh, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's Das Fax Communique. Guten Tag, Fraulein Frank. Fraulein? Isn't Frau... Isn't Fraulein a woman? I mean, admittedly, I do have long hair, as you can see. If I can, but that's a bit rude. Right, well, let's see what they have to say. We wish to buy Steven Bergwijn. Value 28 to 37 million. Get some cash in on him. Let's see what they're offering. The Reich offers 6 million. Danke schön. Uh, do I need the calculator for that one? Ah, I don't think so. I'm not quite sure, but I, I, I was hearing. Never a moment's peace around here. Ah. Oh, do you like my... There's slippers in the background. Where do them come from? That must be the, the cleaning lady who forgot them. Uh, what What is this? Uh, pigeon mail. Did... So it's not even from the facts. Did, did a pigeon land? Did you see a pigeon? I don't, I, I don't know what's going on. Uh, this is... I don't know what, what team this is, but... I think the graphical designer at that team is pretty drunk or something, but let's see if their 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 typewriter is also drunk. A read bunny lad. We wanna sign Getty in Dumbele, who we man? Eh, as suspected. He he sounds pretty drunk. Right, well his value is still fifty to fifty five. Let's see. They are rich, right? Oil money club. Come on. Surely like fifty. Just bit fifty. We offer eighteen million Wayman? Purely belt a lad, doilin plodge spelt dunch. Doilin plodge spelt spelk spelk 
done? What? What? Can we? Do we have a translator somewhere? Like, if anyone knows what any of this means. I mean, all I understood is 18 million. Orit, bunny lad. Well, orit to you as well, oil club. But that's uh, uh let's get the get our calculator out, and then of course. That is a hard pass. Sorry, Newcastle. Right. Well, at least the fax is empty now, so um, roll an intro, because uh, I need to get out of this suit. <music> Greetings, friends and... Frauleins? Yeah, let's go with that. Uh, are you crazy here, or Cindy or Sigurdsson, or just Frank? I mean, you can call me whatever you want. As long as you do call me, cool. So, in the comments below, just write, I'm calling you, or something like that. Or, doot, 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 and I'll definitely pick up. I'll definitely pick up. But, uh, yeah, welcome to Transfer Special, which, uh, if you saw the first bit, is might be, maybe not that super duper special, but it's not quite as bad as my trusty, oh, get rid of this. As my trusty accountant uh, lays it out to be, it's not quite as bad as that. Don't you worry. Now, my face is kind of floating in the middle there. I'm trying to hide the, the ins for now, but uh, let's focus on the outs because, as you can see, Newcastle are basically our sugar daddies, which is which is just lovely. And um, let's see if this thing covers. Uh, it doesn't cover that much, so that's fine. We'll just leave the camera there, right? We sold Lucas Mora for forty million. Not too shabby. Um, he's definitely going to score versus me. I know that, but. He's one of the few players you can actually get decent money for, at least in the start, so I'm not going to use him that much. And I've, I have experience where he kind of drops off, at least he did in FM21, he drops off very fast, and I don't know, 40 million, I mean, how can you say no? Next one we'll, we'll do is Eric Dyer, and yeah, I have renamed him because, yeah, he's just Dyer, isn't he? He's not actually, like, he's not actually that bad attribute-wise, right, but... Come on, it's Eric Dyer. I mean, 15, 15, it's not, it's not terrible, but it's certainly not great either. And uh, yeah, what was it? 25 million, right? Yes. 25 million for Eric Dyer. Definitely happy with that. And uh, the next one is just a bit weird. Like, I was trying to sell Cessignon. I was offering him out. I was even trying to loan him out, and no one, literally no one was interested for any normal kind of money or anything. And uh, just out of the blue, some, some day, like, Newcastle were like, oh, yeah, let's offer... I think it was 25 million plus a player. I'll show you the player in a second. And I negotiated up to 27. Uh, so 27 and a half for, I mean, yeah, cut to the guy we're actually getting in. I, sorry, I had to do it like this so I don't spoil all the transfers. But yeah, they just offered 27 and a half plus Mr. Elliot Anderson, who apparently is a bit of a like wonder kid in the game. I mean, four star potential, but I mean, I was like. Do you know what? I would have taken 27 million just for session on, and then they just throw in a random maybe one to kit. So I was like, pretty chuffed with that. So um, thank you, Newcastle. Or oh, sorry, thank, thank you, Sugar Daddy. Uh, I'll read, I'll read Sugar Daddy and all that. But uh, yeah, so that's what, 92, if I remember correctly, 92 and a half million uh, they just pumped into a club plus a uh, random youngster. So not too shabby, not too shabby. And um, yeah, now though, let's focus on the more exciting things. The ins, what we've all been waiting for, right? And roll the fancy graphics that I just decided to randomly make, which made my day a whole lot more difficult and time-consuming. But uh, as I'm also remembering to move my face, because that's very important. Right, and with the power of editing, I am now comfortably in my little corner down here. Much better. It's warmer down here, by the way. Do you like my sweater? Oh my god, it's freezing here, and I live in Turkey. <laughs> Anywho, yes. We've got in the French speedster that is Anthony Martial. He's on loan from Women UFC, but um, apparently that loan is... I'm not sure. If we qualify for the Premier Division, we can, we can or we must. I'm not sure. First, they tried to sneak, uh, put in a sneaky, like, if we qualify for Euro Cup, they, we, it was obligatory that we did it, the mandatory, all the Tories. Um, and I was like, I'm not having any of that, right? So I just added in a sneaky, like, optional one. And it didn't say anything about Premier Division. But when the deal was actually done, it said qualifying for Premier Division, 25 million. I have no idea what's going on. Gonna 
go on. And I don't expect to, uh, well, hopefully we're not going to get relegated. So we'll see what happens actually at the end of the season. But um, I mean, even 25 million for him, it's not too shabby, right? I mean, look at the 16 dribbling, 16 first touch and technique and rapid. Like, you know him. It's Anthony Martial. And we do need an option for when Kane inevitably either dips in form or just gets injured. So yeah, welcome Anthony Martial. Now, admittedly, as the graphics is showing, the next one is probably a little bit boring. It's just like one of the wonder kids from FM21 at least, but um, it's, yeah, we all know him, we all love him, Thiago Almada. Basically, I just needed some cover in the AMC role, and he just fits everything I want. And um, he also plays both wings in case of, you know, emergency, and he plays them pretty well. What I loved about him in the FM21 is that he just slots right in at the beginning. Now, you can just start him. He doesn't need time to grow or anything like he's ready he's already ready already ready that is some quality english there but um yeah almada in the van let's see how he develops because in fm21 he was incredible right but he's not listed as a wonder kid anymore maybe that's because he's 20 i don't know but look how just ah, well-rounded he is at 20 and he looks happy so that's good next one for the beta players at least, is probably also a little bit boring. It is the German jovial steel that is Niklas Süle, the mechanic at the back, as I've called him. And uh, yeah, if you played beta, you'll know that he's just randomly available and Bayern are desperate to sell him, apparently. They're not going to play him. And I think I've signed him in two other saves as well. He's just incredible, right? But great cover back. I mean, he's probably going to be a starter, to be fair. And I mean, I just love everything about him. Like, he has 16 pace while also having 17 jumping release and 18 strength. He's just so well-rounded, right? 15 heading, 15 marking, 16 tackling. Ignore all the red arrows. Uh, but he's just very, very good. Agility is maybe not the best, but uh, yeah, just absolutely incredible. And we paid, well, 21 million, so. And the last one, as you could see from the graphics, is not actually a Ninja Turtle, even though his real name is Raphael. I'm not making it up. His real name is Raphael, but he goes by the name Rafinha. I'm sure you've heard of him before. And uh, this is an exciting one for me, at least. I've not bought him in either of their fans yet. So exciting one for me. He's just, I mean, he's just class, right? The little beach dribbler or whatever. Like, and look how happy he is as well. He's really happy to be here, which is nice. Um, good acceleration. Great agility as well. Like, uh, maybe we should have him tutor Zulu. But <laughs> maybe not. Just... Uh, just incredible, right? Uh, not much to say, it's, it's bloody Rafinha, and hopefully he'll do really well. Because we paid a lot of money, like 42 million. Maybe it's not a lot, but bear in mind, this is like installments and all sorts, but um, good business by Leeds, I guess, S signing him for 17 and then selling him for 42. It's bloody Rafinha, 16 dribbling, 16 first touch, 17 technique, 17 flair as well. Oh, I'm excited to use this guy, and he can play out on the left as well, which is uh, actually decently. But yeah, he's going to be playing on the right with Sun then on the left as well, because I mean, who may as well just jump right into it? Where is the tactic one? I'm going by my patented. Oh, that's a low red, but uh, yeah, my patented four-two-three-one, and uh, it just fits Tottenham. It fits everything I want. That is a lot of red. What is that? Oh yeah, because we're playing. Um, Euro something something qualifying next round and apparently we haven't done the registration yet uh, but um yeah this is basically the team I mean we could probably put Deli Ali in here instead of Amara in the beginning and uh, where is he Sule definitely for Sanchez so that's basically what we're gonna have to deal with and you know, have to play with uh, but yeah it's gonna be pretty good I think now spoiler alert or disclaimer or whatever I actually recorded all this well yesterday I know that means nothing to you every single bit of this episode I already recorded but then as I was editing it the camera was just lagging and doing all sorts I think because of electricity so I even played a match and spoil I mean you can see that the news are still literally here like uh, okay I lied they're not here but we we already played this match and I did it on camera and we beat Burnley 2-1 uh, 2-0 sorry I can't even I can't even read numbers that's how exhausted I am from talking but um yeah like I said it kind of it didn't corrupt but the whole camera thing was just lagging and i decided you know what i'm gonna do the whole thing again so i did got up this morning made coffee and then i just went ham and recorded so um yeah but that's probably a good a blessing in disguise because actually this episode is going to be pretty long and if you throw a match in there as well even longer but um yeah that was a bit of a transfer special we still do have 
47 million to play with so a sneaky signing here and there is definitely definitely not unreasonable to expect as we're also trying to get rid of some players here and there Tanganga might leave <clears throat> hopefully will leave um, trying to get rid of Bergwin of course but no no good offers yet but we have the facts somewhere it's still here don't worry <clears throat> and uh, yeah in Dombele yeah he's not even wanted anymore but we shall see we shall see so that wraps it up for now at least i'm gonna play hopefully this should be fairly easy we're playing sochi from russia in the boy what is it even euro cup 2 the pathway lake one all, all sorts but um yeah hopefully we qualify for the euro cup i mean should be a double right but uh yeah i'll come back to we'll see when the euro cup actually starts and all sorts and uh when i've done some more transfers so then i shall let you know so yeah thanks for watching like subscribe remember to comment that you're calling me and i'll definitely pick up like i, I promise i promise but uh yeah till next time ciao arrivederci all that